Hey guys, Amber from The Vault here. I am with the game The Solus Project. Guys, I actually requested this from the developer and they gave me a copy and I can't even believe they gave me a copy. I'm so excited about this. I want to play this for you guys. I'm going to be honest, I didn't read. What I do is when I, when I go to pick up a game, I don't read about it. And I purposely do this. I just kind of, I don't look at, I don't look at any of the reviews. I just I get the game. If it's got a cool like look to it or something like that, I just pick it up. And this one had the word survival on it and I didn't read anymore because I just, I wanted to play it as soon as it said survival. I don't know if it's horror or not. I, I don't think so. I think it's just a, a like a regular survival. I don't know. I don't know what it's like, but I'm terrified already because when I started this game up, it was a little scary. So let's see. We have the option to do subtitles and the option for a female voice. I'm going to go ahead and click that just because obviously I am a female and I tend to like to play females in games. So I'm assuming that that's what it's for. It's probably for my character. So let's go ahead and start a new game here, guys. All I know is I've crash landed on a planet and I got to survive. That's all I know. I'm really excited about it guys and thank you so so much to the developer who actually gave me this copy I think I think I said that before but I want to make sure you guys know how much I appreciate this This really doesn't mean a lot to me. I'm so excited to play this I'm so happy to be bringing this to you guys. I can't tell you enough how I'm ready for this I love games where I have to survive especially if they they uh Especially if they're hard <laughs> you guys if you've watched the channel long enough. You know how I feel you know how I feel Okay, guys, so environmental analyst Octavia Skeen. Shit. Somebody's got a dog. Lata, Yuri, can you hear me? Oh shit. Oh shit. Where is everyone? Did Good. anyone make it to the drop pods? Amon, Lars, is anyone there? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Did I press something on accident I didn't mean to? Oh shit. I might have pressed something that I didn't mean to.
doesn't look that bad. Oh, shit. Wake up, girl. Wake up, Octavia. Okay. Well, independent, World local. Independent, local survival overseer node active. Wilson interfacing with operator. Operator vital signs detected. I'm confused as to what's going on right now. I don't know what I just did. Oh, wait. Okay, there we go. Let's see. Select an item to continue. Can be cut. Requires tool. Okay. Can be cut, but requires a tool. So we have a rock. Do we not want the rock? Crafting. Select an item to combine. What would we combine? So there must be another piece around here I'm missing? At least it's the way I'm taking it. Huh. I mean, I must be missing something, right? I ain't crazy, right? Resistance buffs? This game looks cool already. Although I'll admit, I'm confused. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I feel like an idiot. Of course, I usually feel like an idiot when I play games. Okay, it definitely says combine. Can be cut requires tool. Oh! Wow, I'm an idiot. You could cut it the whole time. I just didn't understand how to cut. Because I'm dumb. Sorry, guys. Stretch of desolation. Everything's got such a cool, like, look. To it looks like everything's... Please follow survival training. Find a place to All take shapes. I need to report back to Prolis Command somehow. Better have a look around and see if anyone or anything made it. Those look like fly traps. Don't they? Oh shit, they are! Okay, we'll stay away from that. Oh, guys. I don't know how to feel about this place. This game has a really interesting look to it. I don't know if I'm actually supposed to go over there or if I'm supposed to look for stuff here. I mean, she said look for stuff. Okay, yeah, I think I'm supposed to look for stuff. There we go. Okay. I feel rewarded now for my curiosity. I usually figure games want you to look for stuff, so that's why I figured I'd run around and find something. Sensitivity in here is a little off for me. I might have to see if I can fix that. Feels a little slow. Let's see. Maybe if I do this. Applicable endless torches. Rare. But I can't, like, pick it up. Okay, I can't pick it up or anything. Can I make anything? So I have a pipe, a water bottle, a sharp rock, and a rock. So I wouldn't say it's like a billion things, but it's something. Once you've secured the environment, find a way to communicate with the outside world. Gather parts and build an impromptu transmitter. Never give up hope that you will be rescued no matter how dire your situation. 
What's this? Plant edible. I'm trying to pick it up. Oh, let me. There we go. Okay, here's some more stuff. Another water bottle. Can I not pick up more than one? There we go. Okay. Crafting a torch. Create a makeshift cutting tool using rocks. Cut off dry organic material. Wrap the material around some kind of handle. Apply oil to it if available. Light on fire. Okay, so I bet you now can I make... I mean, I got the pipe. Combine that with the plant. Or I guess the plant's edible. So I probably want to hold the rock. I probably want to use a sharp rock. Oh, that's what I keep doing wrong. You gotta hold it down. Okay, edible food. Find a place to take shelter. Burnable. Can be cut. Requires tool. Okay. So yes, we can use our sharp... And then we can probably make one of the uh, torch out of it? Oop. Yeah, sorry, that is just a little off for me. Caves provide shelter from the climate. Okay, so we cut this off. Got more of that dry stuff. How much water do we need to drink? I mean, do I know? Oh, crap. When they said survival, now I know what they meant. Oh, damn. I'm actually gonna have to look for food and crap, aren't I? Let's be honest. I'm not gonna be able to do it. I'm never gonna survive. What is this thing? Okay, so this is where we take shelter, I reckon. We're gonna have to definitely make a torch out of this stuff. Oh, okay. So let's do, um, let's go ahead and combine these then. So... How do we do that? So I thought it was R2. Hmm. Okay, let me do this. Let me run to the... Oh, I can sprint. Good. Let me run to that wall. And then maybe we'll be able to make a torch. I guess we don't really need a torch, though, right now. Oh, here we go. So, we craft an item. So we put that together. Okay. But this will make endless torches, right? That's what it says? Endless torches, yeah. Okay. So we found our place to hide. Now what do I have to do? Oh, I probably have to grab more of this. Oop, wrong button. I just wanted to take it. There we go. Inventory full. So I can't pick it up right now. Okay. Assuming I can't eat those. Oh, did these grow back? I feel like those grew back. Yeah, they. I think. Or I just cut them and maybe I just cut them. Okay. We're good on water. We're warm enough. Now what do I have to do? I can't pick anything else up. I don't seem to have like a... Oh, here we go. Maybe this will be it. Explorer Diary Landing. It's all up in flames. I... It's all up in flames. I need to report back to Prolis Command somehow. Better have a look around and see if anyone, or anything, made it. Okay, so I think that's what I'm supposed to be doing. Just keep... Oh wait, what did that say? Sleep or find a shrine to save the experience. experience. Okay. Oh crap, it told me how long I survived. Does that mean... 
So I mean, like, I could just die at any moment. Oh, if you guys watch me play, uh... Oh gosh, what was that game? This war of mine, you know that I don't survive very well in these games. Okay, let's see. Launch day! I guess this is it. I still haven't processed it. We all sat in the crow's nest and watched as our big shrine homecoming- Oh wait, home grew. <laughs> big shining home grew smaller and smaller. Sorry, guys. Okay. So there's obviously more we're supposed to discover. Oh, what is that? It looks like it would open up! Oh god! Oh my god. That is- that's bizarre. I can't look at that. That's bizarre. Oh, it's too scary for me. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Oh my god, there's more of them. Those things are horrendous. They look like eyeballs. I can't handle it. So we have some food and we had water. Oh man, guys, I'm nervous about this. I'm bad at games when I have to survive. What's that noise? Oh man, I feel like everything on here is gonna kill me. Oh, what's this? I can't see it all. I can't combine that with the oiled roots. I don't understand. I know how to make a torch, but why can't I actually make it? Okay. I don't know how to make a torch then, I guess. Ah! Oh god, it's one of those little eyeball thingies. Like, is that thing hurt me if I, like, land on it? No. What does it say about it? Nothing? God, it's freaky. Okay. Let's keep moving. Oh, here's something. Oh, it's more food. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. So I might have to drop things is what you're telling me. I hear like a bird or something. I hear multiple birds. Where the hell are we, guys? I mean, seriously, like this thing is crazy. This game is crazy. Look at this. Look at this view. Oh my gosh. All right. Sorry. <laughs> I should get back to actually playing the game instead of just staring at it. What is that? The screen is like shaking. Fuck, am I gonna die? I'm scared, y'all. Is that thing moving? No, okay. What the hell? I swear there's like something behind me. Maybe I can only make a torch at night. I guess that would make sense. I, f I don't know if I should continue along the beach or... I swear I hear like a little animal or something. Maybe I should go this way. Ooh, gross. Pass more of those eyeball things. Gross, gross, gross. Okay, there's more food. Beacon! Inventory full. Navigation aid. Cargo manifest. Okay. But I can't put stuff in here? Okay. I was hoping I could, like, store stuff in here. Okay, well, I feel like that's really important. So... Um... Well, I don't want to leave that behind, actually. I don't want to leave oiled roots behind. Oh my god, what is that thing? Oh, that's more of those things. God, I hate those. Okay, um... Edible can. We don't need to eat, do we? I don't know what our calories really matter. Let's see. So I guess we could use this 
And then... Inventory full. We consume that. Beacon item allows you to mark a location... Oh god, those scare me so much. Okay, so I can mark this. So how do I mark it? Nope, I want to keep that. I want to keep that. How do I mark a location, though? Last forever. Nights are very cold. Okay, I gotta get back to a cave. Okay, we'll figure out how to mark a beacon later. Stretch of desolation, too. Oh my gosh. Well, I gotta find a place to hole up for the night. I can't get in there. Oh shit. I don't know how to use my beacon, otherwise I'd mark this place. Okay. Oh my gosh. I think this is definitely the kind of game you gotta learn. Like, you need time to learn this. I assume I'm getting real cold. Oop, wrong button. Okay. Let's run. That thing is supposed to be really warm, so we could potentially... ...get warm by it. I'm afraid everything's gonna kill me, guys. I mean, if we're gonna go to that, though, I might as well go to the cave. Here we go, here we go. Okay. This should help. I think. Okay, so while we're here, we can drink water. Am I good on water? Yeah. I wonder if I can just keep drinking if it matters. I don't know what to do. I'll admit it. I'm so confused. I think I'm getting too cold, but I don't know how to make a torch. Okay, hold on, guys. Alright, guys, so I guess I just sleep. The experience saves only after sleeping using Savior Shrines. Sleeping recovers health. The longer the better. Quality and ability to sleep is affected by the climate and conditions. Time progresses during sleep. If you die, you can die. Oh, if you're asleep in an unsafe location when your stats are low. Okay, am I not? Sleeping gives you 100 health per hour. Okay, I guess we're just gonna sleep for 10 hours then? I don't know, I might die now, guys. Oh shit, I might die now. <laughs> that was a long time to sleep. What the hell is the... Oh. So I gotta be careful. Okay, now I'm good. Just in case. Oop, wrong button. So I'm still cold, I guess. Imminent starvation? What? I got health! Oh shit. I done fucked up good, guys. Okay, starvation is affecting my health. Oh shit. Okay, guys, this game might be way harder than I thought it was. Oh shit. Okay, I know that there's edible food somewhere. 
Hey guys, thank you so much for watching me play The Solus Project. I just want to say thank you again so much to the developer. Thank you for giving me a copy of this game. I'm so excited to be playing it for you guys, and I hope that you guys are liking it as much as I am. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here, guys. But if you like this video, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. It means the world to me, guys. helps other people find the videos, and of course, it is that huge motivation to keep me moving forward. I really, really do appreciate that. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, go ahead and click on that picture of my big dumb face that should be popping up on the screen very shortly. There'll also be a link to some other video, you know, whatever YouTube thinks you'd like, and then I'll make a playlist of all of the Solus Project videos so you can see them all at once. So I'm going to go ahead and get out of here, guys. I'll see you back in the next one.